and welcome back to my channel subscription boxes and more with Michelle and if this is your first visit well I hope you'll come back and see me again really soon what is it I have to share with you today guys I have a humongous humongous Timu order this is over 50 items in here guys let's see what we get inside yeah, Bugatti. It's not Cat Lady. Yeah, but you want the bag? I know. You like to play inside of everything. Yeah, but you gotta wait. It won't be empty for a few minutes. It's a big one. Alright, let's start with whatever this big thing is. And there's two of them. The other day, I don't know if you remember that I did the video with the cat stuff from my car. Uh, some of the things had been sold out at the time. There's two of these. I'm only going to take the one out of plastic. This is the lumbar pillow. And there's no strap or anything. I kind of wish that there would be a strap that went around it that went over your seat. So that would hold it in kind of in place. But here is the lumbar pillow that goes with the... I have the headrest pillow already. And then there is not the same line. But it's a black like cat paw with white pads I wish they'd be pink but that goes actually on the seat that you sit on and I would like to get those as well so um I'm trying to do my car all up in a crazy cat lady theme in case you haven't noticed and like I said there's two of them here's the other one better not lose my scissors I might need them all right now we have some kitchen sponges um my sister, who is also my home health aide, or my home health aide, who is now my sister because I claimed her and said she is, um, uses those uh, sponge daddies or whatever uh, sponges. She really likes those, and this seems to be... <laughs> I just pulled his mouth out. This seems to be a bit similar to those. Um, you can pull out the eyeball sponge. They didn't come out when they cut it. Um... But now you can see the face. There you can see it on the yellow side or the green side. So this is the more scratchy. This is the more soft. And it seems to be very similar to the sponges that she um, is using that she likes. And um, so I bought her some of those. Her and I. Because, you know, it's not like I don't do any of my own cleaning. But she does the bulk of it. So hopefully those are good. Um... I had gotten some scrapbook paper to use for uh, making a dollhouse and I got like the one that has the brick and stuff so I got some flooring I got this this is the brick one there's another one of these so I'm only going to show you one pack of the wood grain they're white on the back so good for flooring there's uh, two of each one I do believe I hope there is I don't know, a darker wood grain. Then if you want something wood grain that isn't like a flooring, there's... This is a reminder. Did, Did you, you take, take your those? pills? So there's really good... Um, I'll probably have to order more than one pack to be able to do a floor, but I I got two of each, and it's, I mean, I'll need more than that, too, because they're only six by six, but I wanted to see if I liked, you know, if there was enough that I liked before I spent a lot of money, and there is, and I obviously would use this in paper crafting as well, and I thought there was two of each one. It looks like there may only be one of each one, so yeah, I'll definitely need more. So there's only one of each style in the wood grain. Hmm, okay. And we did look at, I have a cat in the bag. I We did look at the brick before, but I'll show it to you since you may not have seen that video. I will show it to you. But I got two of each, so I'll have to show you one half of each. Um, so this is more for the walls or the outside of the building even.
this shows you the different textures. I forget. Yeah, this one has two of each, so I prefer that the wood would have had two of each. I like that one a lot. I'm trying to This is a white one, but it's in its distress, but not as distressed as the one before. It's not got as much peeling paint. So, but uh, what I had said in the video before is maybe they could be used together. So I'll put them side by side. You know, in a pinch, maybe they could be used together, but now I'm not thinking so much. Excuse me. I have allergies. Another orange colored one, you know, a brick colored one. Another. And then this dark one. So, you know, there's a lot. Here's another white, but again, less distressed than the other. Here's kind of a darker one. So these are really nice if you just, you know, wanted to use it just for tag making, card making, that kind of thing. You definitely don't have to use it for dollhouse making or whatever, but it lends itself well to that. This one's nice. They're all nice. I like them all. That's why I bought it again. I only bought one to begin with because I was like, I'm not sure about the quality of their paper. I don't know, you know, if I like it. I don't know how nice the print is, you know what I mean? Uh, the printing um, and the print. And I love it. That's why I bought it again. And I will probably have to buy it a few times to be able to actually make what I want to make. So. And... have a shirt. This is the one I'm thinking. It's hilarious and I love it. You're seeing it before me so hopefully it's the one I'm thinking of. I can't tell if you can see the whole thing. Can you see the whole thing? Okay. I only wanted 10 cats. But if God wants me to have 20, then 40 it is. Only have nine. But it was pretty funny regardless, right? I love it. I'll be wearing that probably tomorrow. What's in here? Ah, this is for my car. There for a minute, I was like, mm, I have no idea what that is. This hangs over the rear view mirror. And I'm not entirely certain why there's a D on one and a C on the other. You guys might know what it is about. I would have really much preferred it have E's, but little black fuzzy cat heads. Okay, hang on the rear view. I thought it went well with the black cats. Hey, get out of there. Thank you. Uh, here for, I've been sewing a lot. So here for my sewing project is a bunch of ribbon. All different colors. Let's hope we don't drop them on the floor. And yes, we are dropping them on the floor. Lots of different colors of ribbon. Use in my sewing. Nope. You may not have it. You may not have it. Matter of fact, I'm going to put it in this because it would be hard to get it in the small one. I'm going to put it in this big one because cat. 
cut through. No, let's not play with this. I'll use this baggie to put this in because cats. The I don't know if you were able to see the these um, things that hang over the review. They have pink on the inside of the ears. So very cute. Um, here is how many? 50 clear bobbins. Can you see them? For my sewing machine that I just got that I need to finish doing the video on. 50 of them. Here is a needle threader for my sewing machine. I want to look and see. I, I thought that the one I got has zigzag. And I think that there's one that costs a little more that does have. And I may buy it as well. Um, somehow... This is a needle threader. I will try to figure it out in the sewing machine video if I can. There's like a needle thing in here that I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna have to read the instructions, but there's some kind of like needle thing that helps put it through. It may be more difficult than just threading the needle. I don't know. You might know exactly how to work it. I don't. <laughs> but I'll try to find if there's instructions, so I'll try to figure it out. Something else for the dollhouse, uh, you know, that I plan to get made. It's going to be one that folds up the dollhouse because I have nowhere to keep it. This is supposed to be like you put on a seat, like maybe a bar stool or whatever. But it's a rug for my dollhouse. It's kind of a velvety or um, leathery look. It's not leather, but you know, because it's a faux fur, but on the back. That over here, I'm try to put it back in the packaging. There are. I tried to make one of those fold up closets, like I'm going to do the fold up doll room. I tried being the operative word, and my stuff doesn't hang, and it didn't work out for me uh, because I don't have anywhere to keep it. And as soon as you move it around, all my hangers that I made or bought didn't make. Bought from Timu, they're too small, they're 112 scale, but. They looked bigger in the picture. I thought they would work, and um, they didn't for, for me uh, for Barbie clothes. So I got these to put the Barbie outfits in to, you know, keep them neat and be able to find them easier, to keep the pieces together. So there's like 20 in the bag. So I might be able to put a couple of outfits in together, and um, but I have another pack of them too. So I'm going to show you the one. Oh boy, what is this? I don't know. Okay. Let's open it up and find out. Something very tiny. Oops. That I just threw on the floor. I'm trying to get it open. Yes, I do have scissors by me. Why am I not using them? I don't know. Too small. Of course, it did say 112, but the thing is, if you go by the pictures, they do those close-up pictures, and it makes them deceiving. They seem bigger than they are, like even by their hand. It's bread, and I wanted to make like I have some extra cheese, and I wanted to make like grilled cheese. And yep, too small. Not gonna work for my purposes. Good thing I didn't pay a lot. All right. Here's the other ones I told you of the bags to put the doll clothes in. And if it works out well for me, I may buy um, more of those. Guys, this reminds me of my spicy. My cat that has the, like, the half white and half black face. Except for she doesn't have long hair, but. Come on, isn't she stinking cute? Stinky cute, huh? Love it. 
Maybe this is the one I'll wear tomorrow. All right, so I have, oh, I'm gonna wait till I find the other one. What do I have here? This is for sewing. And I hope that they work better than the ones I bought at Walmart. I hope that because the ones I bought at Walmart were silicone and, yep, these are hard plastic. And after a couple of uses, my, of course, they're big because I have such little fingers, but my thimbles, the silicone ones, just tore up. And these have hard plastic. They're still silicone here, but they're hard plastic here. There's two of them in the bag, and it's a thimble. So. Oops, sorry, did I scare you? Another thing for sewing. Now, if I would have unboxed this, I could have had these in order and, you know, had it in sections. You know, this for this, this for that. But I just, I just wing it, guys. Because I, I want my reaction to be my true reaction, not a rehearsed reaction. Does that make sense? So we have a zipper case. And it's not quite 8.5 by 11 size, but, you know. And inside of here, oh, stuff's falling out. Well, I'll hold it where you can sort of see it. <laughs> Inside of here, we have all manner of sewing things. There's all these different colors of thread. There are um, safety pins. Boy, the word did not want to come. There's needles that are loose in here. There's this clippy thing. Needle threaders, scissors. The thing of needles came open, so the needles are everywhere in here, so I can't... Um, there are some bobbins, there's another little clippy thing, another little clippy thing, uh, another couple of them, thimbles, um, pin cushion and straight pins, and there's even um, the multicolored threads here, if you can... I'm trying not to lose any needles. Um, the, like, variegated... Um, a little magnifying glass, but there are needles every place. I think they went in this, possibly. I think they were supposed to be in this. I'm going to try to put them in there, the ones I can find. But I can't hold it up because I can't have needles going everywhere and my blind husband step on one or my cats, you know, get one and think it's a toy or step on it. Or me step on it with my diabetic feet. Thinking this is what it went on. Boy, there are needles everywhere. I'm not going to be able to find them all. I'm going to have to actually take this apart to find them all. There are snaps in here. There are um, um, plastic needles like you would use for like plastic canvas or something. There's a needle threader. There's a crochet hook, which is... Um, especially needed because I can't find my crochet hook. Um, a seam ripper, a pair of like tweezer looking things, a measuring tape, um, things for like when you're crocheting it marks your spot or knitting or whatever it is. Um, guys, I don't know if I have all the needles, so I'm going to just put that on there and, um, there's a pencil, or there's buttons, there's a pencil for marking your fabric, and then it washes out. Hopefully you can see that well enough, but I don't know if there's more needles or not. So, yeah, somebody didn't cap that real well. Or, you know, just shipping, I don't know. Who knows, could be a combination of things. There's small scissors, there's bigger scissors. See, um... Two different size scissors. There's it's just got an incredible amount of things in there. And nice and portable. And you know, the sewing machine itself was nice and portable. So I thought, you know, it seemed like a good combination. But again, because I don't know uh if I have all the needles, that's the best I can show you. There's a whole thing of needles besides that small thing of needles. So um I thought it was a good deal. You'll have to see the price and tell me what you think. Um, I'll put it up there, or have put it up there by now. 
trying to put some of the things in the... I'm just making a bigger mess. All right, nope. So I'll leave it alone. Do it later when you can put it on a table. I have to put something on the end of the zipper, one of those safety pins or something, to make it easier to find the zipper. All right. Thought that would be handy for my crafting. I wish they wouldn't have damaged my sticker. She believed she could, but her cat was asleep in her lap, so she didn't. That's what it says. Gonna go in my car. Out. What is this? Well, I know what this is, but I'm saying what is this because this is not what I was supposed to get. I was supposed to get the little Keurig cups, and I got these. Not what I ordered. So I'll have to get my money back out of that so I can reorder them. Uh, for my Miniverse kitchen, there's itty-bitty little orange slices. I've got the lemon ones. Now I have the orange ones. Uh, seam ripper for my sewing projects. Of course, that came with one, but I thought this one was really neat. It has, it folds up. It has this that flips around, and you don't have to worry about losing your lid because it's attached. So, I like that for not losing my lid flipping my lid um this is really neat i i'm a little bit of an artist and so i thought these were really neat hair thing hair uh, clippies they are let me get them out so i can show you they are colored pencils are these real colored pencils I'm confused. Hang on. Oh my gosh, guys. They took real colored pencils and glue clippies on them. I think I lost my scissors. Yeah, I did. I need those. <sighs> okay. They took real colored pencils and put clippies on them for your hair. And it, it really writes. I guess if you're, you know, in a pinch and you need to write down somebody's phone number, you take your hair clippy out and there's red cats green a brown yellow blue and black colored pencils that they turned into hair clippies how funny and cute is that I thought they were plastic I did not realize they took actual colored pencils and turned them into hair clippies that's pretty cool I like that. I got Easter colored um, washi tapes, you know, different prints and colors for Easter, spring. And there's a lot on each one, really. Plaids and polka, no, I thought they were polka dots too. Just plaids, different spring plaids. I thought that was polka dots, but it's plaid. All right. Cool. And there is one, two, three, four, five, six, twelve of them. Here is a sticker from my car that says Cat Mom. You'll see them on the car. I am really going to... I've never once put a sticker on a vehicle. And I'm going to do it this time. It's my car. I'm going to run it till it's dead. And then I'll probably push it or drag it. Because I'm not going to be able to afford another car. So I'm just going to keep it. So why does it matter if I put stickers on it? Here's one. They go on it too. Meow. Been wanting that one for a while. I'm turning it into a crazy cat lady car. Because I'm a crazy cat lady. This is also for that same line of stuff in my car that I've already gotten. And this goes on the seat belt. So there's two of these. Um, I will get ones for the back seats eventually probably. Why it has a cotton tail like a rabbit, I'm a little confused. 
But alrighty then. I don't care. It's cute. Goes with it. See, it's got the same cat head. So cute, huh? So there's two of those in here. I'll only show you the one. Um, for my Miniverse kitchen, and I'm glad these actually are a size that I can use, because after the bread, I was like, mm, maybe not. Um, yes, I know, I've got scissors. Why am I not using the scissors? Um, I got plates. Yellow plates, because, you know, the kitchen got yellow accents. And they have them in different colors, and I may get the other colors as well, because I didn't want to get any more until I saw if they were going to be of a size that would be able to be used. And they are. They may be not as big, but like that single hamburger could go on there real nicely, and that's going to go on there. But there's five of them. Five of them in yellow, and I will probably get the other colors as well, because... Um, they will actually work for smaller, you know, single servings of things in my kitchen. What are we doing? Charlie Bill. Alright. I got a bag that was blue and red, and I loved it so much for using for my, um, miniverse stuff, my resin stuff, that, um, that I decided to get another bag for my sewing stuff. Battery died. All right, so anyways, I was saying I really like that bag. Th this one's not the same, but the bag that I have my sewing stuff in right now is just a drawstring bag and everything is just in one spot and I can't find anything. What I need is always at the bottom, kind of like your purse, right? Uh, so this one's a different design than the one that I got for my resin stuff, and the only thing I, the only criticism, the only criticism I had about that bag is that the pockets were on one side and the ends, but it didn't go around on the other side. For the sewing stuff, I'm going to need more pockets, so I got this one that does have the pockets all the way around and also on the ends, um, but this one doesn't have the flat bottom. It has a flat bottom, but I mean, it uh, doesn't have the piece to keep it open, keep it flat, and, or um, you know what I mean? And so all I have to do is cut one out of like foam board or something and that will keep it so it'll sit nicely and it has all these pockets for things like scissors and you know things that you need to find. Um, I think this kind of can draw up and make it tighter. I don't want to do that or maybe it's there's one over each pocket so it's like for your say the handle of your scissors or whatever so I don't know. There's no pockets on the inside. I kind of wish, it's such a big spot. I kind of wish there was, but I think it's meant to hold like garden tools or something. I don't know. Regardless, I use it from my sewing stuff. I wish that it had like a um, magnetic snap here and I may go buy one and put it there. Um, but yes, for what I need it for, it's going to work really well. Um, Crazy Cat Lady sticker for my car. Uh, speaking of Crazy Cat Lady sticker for my car, I realize you can't really see it. I'll get this. The rest of them you could sort of use your imagination, but this one I want to get out if I can. I don't want to use my scissors because I don't want to accidentally cut the sticker. And I want to be able to close it back up in here. My sister and I are going to have to go and decorate my car later when she gets here. Me, yes. Mm. There, you can see it a little better. Okay. Put it back in, close it up, and wait until she gets here so we can put the decorations on the car. And there'll be a separate video of the stuff installed and stuff okay because this is going to be a long video as it is okay then there are these and as you can see they are 
opposite directions and therefore the uh, rear view mirror one on one one on the other so this one you can see better because this one they have the sticker but they're looking opposite ways my dad would absolutely not be a throw uh, a fan of me putting stickers on my car the other pack of these Oh, I was saying I needed a crochet hook. I got a crochet hook. I thought that this would be comfortable to hold. And I don't know what size that is. I'm thinking kind of like a... In their letters, it would not be like a G size or something like that. I don't know. No idea what's in here. This is for my brother. And I hope to see him in May, so, and his birthday's in May. Um, you have to remove the covering. I hate to do that because I'm not going to be able to give it to him right now. But if I don't do it, you won't be able to see it because this thing is on it that says remove this. Okay, I'm going to put it over this so you can see it a little bit, and then I will read it to you. You can read it to yourself if you want to. It has a um, stand, a wooden stand that it sits on. It says, to my brother, never feel that you are alone, no matter how near or far apart. I am always right here, or I am always right there in your heart. If I had to choose between loving you and breathing, I would use my last breath to say I love you. I will always be there to support you. You will always be my brother. My brother's been going through a tough time, so. Let's see if I can put that back on it for right now to keep it safe. I'm going to just put it over it a little bit so the wood doesn't scratch it up. And put the wood on that side. Hope I don't lose it between now and when I see him in May. I'll probably put it in my suitcase after this video so I don't forget. Something else for the dollhouse. And it's well, 1 12th scale so I hope it'll work. Because like I said, those pictures can be deceiving. There's two of them in here. But I'm only going to show you the one. Because it's a little, I think it'll work. A little small candle stick. And there's two of them in the package. Cute. More of the wood grain. So like I said, there was two of each kind. Which gives me three of the wall covering. That's the other shoulder belt thing. Hey, get out of there. I told you there was more than 50 items, so. Okay, <laughs> you're going to think I'm a weirdo, and you probably already think that anyways. But this is also for my car. You know how people um, at Christmas have, like, the deer antlers, things like that. Well, I have cat ears for the top of my car. I'm going to show you one because... Cat have two ears. Uh, to hold it, it has a cat paw, and then this piece of foam comes out, and the ear goes in where that piece of foam was, and then it's got adhesive. Hopefully, it holds it well because I don't want my ears blowing off in the wind. One on each side. It's got to push down in there even farther. It doesn't want to go all the way down. It just takes a little work. Cute. 
cute, huh? Two of them. Get my sister to help me with all this stuff. Told you I wanted to, I want people to see it come in and say, there's a crazy cat lady. I want to wear that badge loud and proud. I have one of these. I have one of these from, um, I can't think of the name of the company. Anyways, when I was, had my scrapbook store, it is a miniature iron, but I couldn't find the cord to it the other day. And like for doing your ribbon and things like that, or um, a pleat or a crease or whatever in doll clothes that you're trying to sew. Um, yeah. Got an on and off switch, plugs in to the iron right here, and plugs into the wall. So it's not a rechargeable one, but that's okay. That'll be nice. Hopefully it works. I will plug it in and we will see. I will tell you if it gets hot. Watch out. Get in the cord so I can tell you. Okay. Sorry, I'm off camera a little bit, but. Turn it on. It has a light that indicate that it's on, a red light. Oops. I pulled on it and unplugged it. It is warming up. I don't know how hot it's going to get, but it's getting hot enough you don't want to hold your hand there very long. Okay, so it does work. I'm sure it's going to work well enough for what I need. It gets pretty warm pretty quick. So, yeah. Excuse me. Excuse me. Let me get my seat back, please. All right, so that was the plate. Sorry, I thought... Okay, I just want to say, I thought I sat something down here. This has, like, I think six paw print stickers. Six or eight. Let me see if it says. No. They go, like, on the side of my car. I'm making another pack of them. Um, really? That's all the... I'll tell you in a minute. Um, not what I thought I was drawing obviously. That happens occasionally, you know, with any of these companies. Um, this goes around the rear view mirror. Little cat. The same cat, you know. I'm trying to get all the pieces and parts so that it all matches. I'm trying to see. Oh. Have you seen the picture, the stickers of, like, the cat bursting out of the car? Well, that's what I... I thought I was getting one that was more like this. This is what I got. But I put it on the car, probably not. I'll probably put it on my laptop. Not what I was, I have one on my wall and uh, that's what I thought I was getting. So, Michelle, I'll read the fine print. I'm sure it had the measurements and yeah, it's supposed to look like Mr. Nubbins bursting out of the, it's too small for my car. That is disappointing. Um, may not be as thrilled with these in person. These are paper, they're for, meant for paper crafting. They're not meant, meant to put on the wall, but I was thinking that I could make frames for some pictures, and I still might be able to for my dollhouse. Um, there's like multiples of the same frame, like three of each. But not, not so much what I wanted. I might just send these to my friend in Ohio. This one's not too bad. I might use that one. I might send her the ones I won't use because she will use them in paper crafting. Does use them a lot in paper crafting. And that's what they're meant for. They weren't meant to put on the wall. But um, I was going for something else. I'm just showing you a few. 
like some of them that I do like, like I like this one. So I will probably use the ones I like and then send her the ones that um, I'll like. Not that I don't like them, but I don't like them as much for um, wall art for my dollhouse. I'm not sure. I was trying to see how many are in it. I'm not sure. Perfect for her use. Again, much smaller than what I wanted. This says crazy cat lady and has a lady with the cats. I'm showing you on this side um, because this side you can't see. Uh, I was hoping that it was like three times the size, or at least twice the size. Oh. I was never able to get the roses for the Valentine um, mini-verse, so I got these roses and hope to put them in a vase. They don't have leaves, but, you know. Mm. That was open. This is what I thought the other coffee filters were supposed to be. These are for your, this one got smashed, but for the K-Cups. For the reusable K-Cup things, they are a game changer. I try to get them in most orders that I get because I drink about four cups of coffee a day, three or four. And um, those reusable things are such a pain in the neck to clean. But this you just pull out, rinse out the thing real good and good to go and uh, makes it a lot more doable. Here is a Barbie dress or a fashion doll dress and hat. And I know the hat's not gonna fit her right, but it's got Velcro to hold on to her hair. It, I wish it had a little more of a hat shape instead of a flat, you know. Here's the dress, it's sort of a mermaid tail style. And then the hat, you kind of set at a jaunty angle, you know. Hopefully it'll look all right, I don't know. And we can see one of these zip zipper bags. Hey, okay, so I'll see if I care. because I don't want to put it back in that plastic. I don't want to fight it in there. Get one of these out. And you could even put the shoes that you want to go with it and everything in the pouch. That's kind of the way I was looking at it. But something like, well, there with the hat. Something like this, I was thinking, well, you know, you could lay it flatter so that it would um, hopefully take the wrinkles out a bit and then I've got that little iron if I need to but you can put the hat in the you can put the jewelry the shoes the whole nine yards you know there's plenty of room and zip it closed and everything will stay in there and then put this in it to a bin like file things you could even put like little tab things to you know, gown, whatever, on the tab. You know what I'm talking about? The sticky tabs. Uh, more of these. I told you I buy them all the time. More of the coffee filters. Um, this I bought for me. Uh, kind of dumb. I hugged for myself, but I liked it, and I wanted it, and so I bought it. If I can get it open, I'll show it to you. I'm just trying to turn the little cat around. It had a sticky thing on it, but apparently it's not going to stay. All right, so it says a little hug, and it's got this little, like, resin cat. It's flat on one side, and it's got, like, hands around. And it says, um, here's a little hug for you to make you smile when you feel blue, to make you happy when you feel sad. The littlest hug you've ever had, but when it's time to hug once more, there are lots more hugs for you in store. Love you lots. Um, 
I thought I could give it to my sister, but I kind of want that little cat for me to carry in my pocket, just as a reminder. So and Then there is this to hold my tablet. It looks bigger in the picture, but hopefully it's just right to hold my tablet at night when I'm watching videos. And of course it's a cat paw, so had to have it, right? Good, it's um, it's a little stiff, so it's not going to, the weight of it's not going to make it fall down. So it's got little grippy feet on this side, so that hopefully it doesn't slide. And it's got little grippies, this is sort of grippy, like silicone-y, and it's got it here too, to hold it. So let me get my tablet, which has paw prints all over it, because it really dirty needs cleaned because cats so yeah and then you know set it how you need it and set it on your bedside table or whatever very nice very 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 happy with that they'll knock it down it'll end up under the bed but you know I think we're almost done. A box of straight, that's just a box of straight pins. I don't want to open it up because we don't need straight pins going everywhere. But I needed some more straight pins. And is there anything else in here? No, that would be it, guys. What, and plus, part of this order was that little, um, I'll show you that came by itself this little uh light it's like a desk lamp for the barbie dolls that really does work sorry i didn't mean to shine it in your eyes but love it and um it came in some other colors i believe so i think i'm going to order some more of them uh it says my lamp led mini lamp I already put it together so it doesn't fit back in the box but uh that is my order this time what do you think of this huge order i'm excited there's only a couple of things i was disappointed in and that being um these two stickers being too small i may use this to be like bursting out of my gas cap maybe something like that because it'll fit on the gas cap but i had um a cat that supposed to be peeking out over the gas cap so I may use that instead and this little uh, crazy cat lady is just so small people are gonna have trouble seeing it unless they're right on my bumper and I don't particularly want to encourage them to be right up on my bumper but I will probably put it on there somewhere just because but I am disappointed that it's so small I may have to um, try to order one from a place you know that makes them to your specifications and say hey I want this but I want it bigger um, And I have cats arguing over, I don't know, either the spot on the bed or a bag or something behind me. <laughs> Anyways, guys, tell me what you think or just stop by and say hi. And while you're there, please give me that big old thumbs up because, you know, that would really help my channel. And please subscribe to my channel and please share my video with others so that maybe they might subscribe as well. Thank you so very much for watching and for listening to me babble. And don't forget... I'm going to put the cat stuff in the car in a different video so that you can see my car all decorated up. All right, guys. Bye.